Hi everyone, Eric with Midas and thank you for joining me here at Music Group TV. You know, we recommend you go ahead and update the firmware whenever you get a chance, especially before you start a show. That way you don't miss out on any of the improvements or updates that we might have going on for you. It's really easy to do on the M32. Let me go ahead and show you how to do that right now. Okay, so now we're at the uh, Midas homepage here at MidasConsoles.com. I'm going to hit products and scroll down here to live performance systems. And I'm gonna go ahead and click on the M32 here. And uh, over here we have downloads. I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. And I'm gonna scroll down here with all the stuff that we got. And at the bottom of the page to the left here, I have my M32 firmware. Just uh, make sure it's the latest one. We're at uh, 2.12 at the moment. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. And there we go, it's just that quick. And then I'm gonna come up here and get to the download and open it. And I wanna grab the DCP file, which is right here. And then I'm gonna click on it, and then I'm gonna go ahead and drag it to my thumb drive, which I have inserted here on my, uh, my computer. There we go. And uh, once it's copied to my thumb drive, I go ahead and extract it. And there you go, and I'm ready to go ahead and take this thumb drive and put it onto my M32. Okay, so there's actually two ways to update the firmware on your M32. And one of the ways to do it is to insert your thumb drive while the M32 is powered down. Uh, once it's inserted into the slot, just go ahead and hold the view button down, turn on the console, release the button. As you can see, it's starting to do its thing here. And once that's done, it'll uh, power on the board and you're ready to go. Okay, so here's the other way to update your firmware on your M32 while the console is powered on. All you have to do is insert your thumb drive with the update on it. Go to your setup menu, scroll down here on system control, select update FW, which stands for firmware, and go ahead and depress the encoder, select your file. It's gonna ask you, hey, are you sure you wanna do that? Yes, I am. And there you go, it's doing its thing. It'll take maybe about a minute, and then you're good to go. Okay, well there you have it. Those are the two ways you can update the firmware on your M32. I had a great time showing you how to do it. I'm Eric with Midas. Thank you for watching Music Group TV. See you next time.